Hi, everybody. I just learned yesterday that some of the two-year-old classrooms are watching the videos. So hi to you guys. I am Miss Cherie and I teach the threes at Grace Preschool. And so some of you might be able to have me as a teacher in the fall and I'm glad you're watching. And hi to all of my current four-year-olds because everybody's four now and maybe some of the two-year-olds are already three. So hi to all of you guys. Today's story is Little Chick's Happy Easter, and it's by Wendy Lewison. This is the cover of the book. It tells us the title of the story, what the story is going to be about, and it shows us a picture too, so we know what it's, what it's going to be about. So my guess would be it's about a little chick who paints, who's an artist, maybe paints eggs. In the back of the book, looks like this. Most of the time it has words on it for parents to read about. And this is the inside of the book. This is where the story, it, the words of the story are on the inside. And a safe way to turn a book's pages are the corners so it doesn't tear or rip. So let's start our story. Little Chick wakes up one day he sees that Easter is on its way. And look, there's a calendar and it says April in fancy writing, that's called cursive. And they circled the number 14 for Easter. But this year, Easter falls on number 12. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 10, 11, 12. So, if we were circling for this year, it would be on the number 12. Easter happens on the 12th of April this year. I'll give mama an Easter surprise, but what will it be, little chick size? He wants to give his mom an Easter surprise, so he's trying to figure this out. Maybe you are too. Cluck, 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 says Mama Hen. I will be back at half past 10. Little Chick sees the eggs and then, hmm. Peep, 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 says Little Chick. Mama is gone. I must be quick. He rolls each egg out of the nest. What is he rolling it with? He has wings, not hands, so he has to use something else to roll it. That's his beak. He's got to do it very gently so he doesn't crack them. Maybe a basket would be best. So he's putting the eggs in a basket. Moo, 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 says Mrs. Cow. What is Little Chick up to now? Into the workshop goes Little Chick. Soon he's done. All the farm animals are watching. Quick, 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 back to the hen house he goes again. Just in time for Mama Hen. Little Chick says, surprise, surprise. Mama can't believe her eyes. What did Little Chick do for her? He painted the eggs. And this one is purple, yellow, orange, and some polka dots and blue. 
This one has diamonds. How pretty she says, you are a dear. Then all of a sudden, what do they hear? Look at them hugging. Peck, peck, peck. Then what do they see? Do you see something in the nest happening? Yes, the eggs are cracking. What's gonna happen? Do you think that little chick rolled them too hard and they broke? Or what do you think? Can you make a hypothesis? What's coming out of the eggs? Make a guess. The eggs are hatching one, two, three. Now Mama Hen has an Easter surprise and Little Chick can't believe his eyes. So now Little Chick is surprised. What came out of the eggshells? Baby chicks. This Easter surprise is like no other. Two little sisters and one little brother. So if you have um, a baby born in your family that's a boy, it's called a brother. And if you have a girl uh, born in your family, a baby girl, it's called a sister. Sometimes we have older brothers and sisters too. So everybody is having a great time with their family on Easter in this story. I hope you guys have a great Easter with your family.